Hey guys, so today we went shopping and I thought I would do a bit of a shopping haul for you. I love watching people's haul videos, I really do, because <laughs> I'm nosy and I like to see what people buy, so hopefully there's a few of you that feel the same. <laughs> But we went to a fair few shops today, so we went to Smith's Toy Stores, a local comic book shop, a Poundland, I'm just trying to think now, CEX, a local game store and Home Bargains. We also had a Coupland's for lunch, but I can't show you that obviously. <laughs> but there's really a big mix of everything in here, household stuff, uh, toys, comics, video games, quite a bit. So anyway, I thought I'd film the haul for you. So let's start with Poundland. So I actually went in there because there is a new um, Thumper purse and a Bambi bag. Mine didn't have them, but I am still on the lookout for that Thumper purse. But that's why I went into Poundland. So I didn't actually buy too much in there because I wasn't really supposed to be going in. So we've got, of course, some sweets. Haribo strawberry softies. I just love these. The Haribo roulette and Haribo baller bites, the strawberry. Just love them. Three for uh, three pound. Can't go wrong. Then exciting stuff. I don't know how much these cost, but we got some batteries because we need them for the PlayStation 2 controller and another controller, I think. And the last thing in Panland was this uh, calming lavender essential oil. It's supposed to help you sleep, so I thought I would grab some. I think that was 79p, 89p, something like that. So that was actually it from Panland. Not a lot. We'll move on to CEX now. So for £6, I picked up Horizon Zero Dawn Complete Edition. This has a DLC with it, I think, even though it says no DLC. But if you look on the back, it says includes uh, the Frozen Wilds expansion. So I'm not sure. But uh, yeah, I if you if you're on my video gaming channel, you'll know this. I downloaded Horizon the other one, Forbidden Forbidden West, thinking it was the first game. And actually, this is the first game. So I needed to get the first game because I'd love to play the Horizon series. Then the next two games my husband picked up, I know very little about these. So we have Bionicle on the PlayStation 2 for £3. Couldn't tell you anything about it. I believe they were toys though, right? And Worms 3D on the PlayStation 2. This cost him £3.50. Again, I can't tell you much about them. Uh, they're my husband's games. And that's so random. I've never seen this in CX before. It says this box is empty. It's not. I do have the game and everything in there. How strange. I wonder if that's to stop thieves. I'm not sure. I've been to CX many, many times. I've never had anything with this on it. So you'll have to let me know if that's a new thing they're doing. I have no idea. So that was it for CEX. Uh, in the spirit of keeping up with games, we'll move on to my local gaming store. And I picked up this pink uh, PlayStation 2 controller for £25. So you guys might know that I've been wanting the pink PlayStation 2 Slim. I haven't got the PlayStation 2, the pink PlayStation 2 Slim. Slim, I can't speak today, it's too hot. I haven't got the pink PlayStation 2 Slim. But I do, I did recently buy the PlayStation 2 Black Slim. So I've got a black console and a pink controller. That's good enough for me, I'm just happy to have the Slim. So we'll now move on to Home Bargains, and this is a real mix, as you can imagine, when you shop at Home Bargains. I'll flick through these quick, because some of these are very exciting. As you can see in front of you, we have two packs of wet wipes for a pound. Some Listerine. This is very exciting. I don't remember the prices of everything. Some Listerine. Now, this is a kid's one, because you'll have to let me know if you're like this as well. The adult mouthwash I find far too strong. I can't deal with the taste. It makes me feel sick. So I do use kid's mouthwash, yeah, because I do find the taste much easier to, to swallow. Don't swallow mouthwash. <laughs> um, you'll have to let me know if you're like that as well. I just think adult mouthwash is so strong. And I don't know if there's a difference, you know, with uh, how healthy it makes your teeth. But I just have to have kid's mouthwash. Then, really exciting, two packs of interdental brushes. A Dove body spray. See, we're on to the bath items now, like the bathroom items. This is for my husband. I love the smell of brew. Is that how you say it? Brew? Bro? I don't know how you pronounce it, but I love the smell. So I made him get this. <laughs> this is my favourite one. Then, of course, two face masks. So we have white chocolate fondue and the birthday cake peel-off mask. I love the smell of these. And I do love the Seventh Heaven. They're probably my favourite brand of face mask. And they're nice, cheap and cheerful. And then a three pack of razors, of course. <laughs> so that's the bathroom type bits from Home Bargains. We'll move on to kitchen. I don't have many. I'll pop these in the kitchen section, but exciting stuff. Multi-surface wipes. I'd ran out. I needed some more. Then I needed some of these. We have large, eight large foil trays and lids. We recently got an air fryer and apparently you can put these in them. So you'll have to let me know all about air fryers if you know anything. Because they're brand new for me, so I'm just learning. And similarly, we got 12 of the medium foil trays and lids. And then I got 100 of these air fryer liners because we've just been using um, tin foil for now. So I thought we'd get the uh, 
liners. Yeah, there's nothing more to say. I think these were a pound each, so I think it's a real bargain. So on to a couple of miscellaneous items from Home Bargains. I got these Thumper socks for £1.50. You know I love Thumper. And finally for Home Bargains, these Thumper slippers because look at them, they're so cute. And they were £6. So I didn't come back with the purse, unfortunately, but I did come back with some slippers. So two more shops to go for this haul. We'll go to Smith's now. Now, I don't know if I've said it here or on my gaming channel or both, but we did a stupid thing. We decided to start collecting Pokemon cards this year. <sighs> we did a stupid thing. <laughs> so me and my husband, mainly my husband, bought a lot of these. So we have this Scarlet and Violet Temporal Forces Elite Trainer Box, the other Temporal Forces Elite Trainer Box, the Scarlet and Violet Twilight Masquerade Elite Trainer Box, I got this because I wanted the tin. It's the, look at, look at the dog. Is it called Dash Bun or something like that? So, so cute. So I got this for the tin. I've got two tins now. I absolutely love them. And then, I'm so sorry, I forgot what these are called, but we have two of these tins. So we have that one and that one. So yes, there is a lot of Pokemon cards there. And uh, I'm not going to tell you how much we spent on them quite a bit, but we have been saving up for ages for this trip. So it's one of them. It's not like we can afford this every time we go now, but we have been saving up for this trip. So then finally moving on to my local comic book store, I got a few bits. I got this little Scooby-Doo keychain for £2 because I just thought it was cute. Then I got a few Buffy comics uh, for £2.10 each. I don't even know if I already own these, to be honest. I need to go through my Buffy comics. So for this uh, trip, I just based solely on the pictures. I got this one. I love that picture of Willow. This one of Dawn holding Buffy. And this one of Buffy and Willow. So that was all the comics. Like I say, £2.10 each. And the last item for this video is this, the Batman uh, Selina Kyle Unmasked. This was 19 99 I do collect Batman figures, as you know, and I decided to go for this one today. It was between this or the Birds of Prey Harley Quinn, and I went for this one. And again, 19 99 So that's the whole haul, minus some tins of Dr Pepper, a Couplins, and some bacon rashers, as in the crisps. I'm obsessed with bacon rasher crisps. I do like frazzles, but specifically the cheap pound bag of bacon rashers. I can devour them in a day. So apart from those, that's everything. So thank you very much for watching. Like I like to say with all these haul videos, this is not to show off at all. I'm just nosy and I love watching people's haul videos. So hopefully some of you enjoy watching this one. That's all it is. So thank you very much for watching and I'll see you all soon. Bye bye.